two signees and Kara Aker and Grace McCallum. It could be a solid, solid team. Already better than it is, which would be hard to believe for the fourth ranked team in the country preseason. It is, and we'll only be losing one gymnast, which Emily is a big loss, but retaining two of those seniors is huge. All right, Crystal Issa, fifth up for the Red Rocks on being this afternoon. Yeah, I think we witnessed our first wobble on her kickover front. She just had a little wobble, but moved right out of it and pulled it up in her series and did a really nice flick lay. She normally does a back handspring layout layout, so she does two of those layout step outs in a row, which is a really tough series. Utah Gymnastics doesn't water down their beam routines to make them easier and more likely to stay on. They definitely go after that those tough skills, but here tonight, she only did that one layout. Crystal Issa ranked ninth in the country on beam as we wrapped up things last year. The dismount with the second team All-American